Sup guys, it's this roll for Replay Thursday episode 10. Damn it. Double digits guys, we did it. Yay. Uh, we have, uh, yeah, I don't know I'm supposed to say that name. It's like Do, and then it's I, and then it's Two, and then it's I, and then it's N. Do, 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 tu, do Twin, Do Twin, Do Twin. Do twin. Because you, you you kinda have to like expect is two to mean two. So Dwight twin? Dwight twin? Dwight twin. So submitting by submitted by Dwight twin. <laughs> uh alright, alright, so <laughs> it's a PVZ and apparently we have another gate expand. Damn it! Dude, is it am I They did the same thing. I don't what? Where? Like, who are they watching? Who has inspired them to do a build I don't like? But it's okay, it's okay. Not everyone likes everything, and everyone, uh, sadly. Uh, <laughs> I'm a plat player on NA, so I went to EU to do my placement, and second match, I'm up against the master. Oh no! That's what had me, help me! I'm scared! I'm scared! Um, I went for the Tuzal, Aras, Mothership Core, and forced him to make links while I take a second, then all in two base immortal sentries. Well, I'm wrong. For me, I didn't scout to see if he took a third, but it didn't work out for him that he took a fourth, a third and fourth, so he was punished for his greed. How could, how could I have been more effective with this build? Alright, so we'll try to stay objective. Uh, try to stay objective. Um, like, I, like, like I've said before, I'm not a big fan of this build because... Uh, well, but then again, like... People in lower level leagues, you know, they're kind of confused and don't know what to do. So I guess it kind of evens out. Uh, it kind of evens out. But I, I feel like the the forge style, uh, grabbing like an early third, gives you like a better sense of macro and late game compositions. So I see a lot, <coughs> I see a lot of people, and I guess this guy is the perfect example. Is I see a lot of people turn turn this push into an all in. So, uh, but yeah. So, how, how can you improve this build? Uh, let's see if you get Supply Block. Let's see if you waste Chrono Boost. So far you seem to be doing okay. Oh, a little bit of wasted Chrono. Oh, a little bit of Supply Block. Well, not so bad. Um, yeah, you seem to be doing okay. Went pretty well for Plat. Here again, uh... You know, like, the reason, uh... The reason, I guess, Sase, or the person who's doing this build, would make the gate next to the next to the nexus is that if they six pool it's easier to defend with probes but then I don't know if he does it but I think you should is you should make the second pylon and the core here um, well actually hmm. eee, eee. I would have fought the links there when he chased you a little bit. Uh, yeah, I don't know about the core. Cause like, this guy... Well... Yeah. This guy took no gas, but you, you don't know that. Like, you can die of an all-in and... You're not redoing your wall, so that needs to be improved. Uh, at least, unlike the last guy, you're getting a forge early. So you're gonna have good upgrades, so I like that. So... You're, you're winning points in my book. Uh, sadly... Oh god! Oh god! Ah! Uh, sadly, your wall is non-existent. Like, that's... You just, you know, like, make a panel, make the wall, leave a entrance for the Zot. Uh, but you're doing fine with workers. Uh, you said Immortal Sentry Allen was their immortal. Oh god! Oh god! Okay. It's not because you're plat that this is acceptable, you know? The goal of being plat is to get better. And then the goal of being diamond is to get better. The goal of being master is to get better. The goal of being grandmaster is to win monies. If you don't make monies, then you're kind of sad. But it's okay. It's okay. Uh, but yeah, you know, like, uh, non-stop chrono boost on the immortals. Uh, make more sentries. You want to stop at 8 sentries if you're going to do a build like this. Uh, but yeah, like that 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 row of pylon is just like you could. Uh, that's not macro. That's like uh, okay. I'm just gonna make stuff, 
And uh, yeah, that's not macro to me. Uh, after eight centuries, you go into stalkers. Uh, reason being, zealots are pretty bad. Uh, because like, yeah, zealots are pretty bad. You just want stalkers. Stalkers, the yeah. Alright, so here again, I have a lot of money. Like, it's okay to warp in over here, as long as you warp in. And you're on six gates, you should have seven or even eight gates. But yeah, you were right, this guy played like really greedy, he was going into mutas. Another reason to make more stalkers, I guess. Uh, no force field. Uh, so, you know what I would do, if we look at your Aki's... What? Aki, you just aki some gates, that's why it's messing up. We look at your Aki's if we go back a little bit so I can give you more tips. Uh, you know, I would just do a move command on the Immortal with the Mothership Core so you can force field better. Because you force field the, the links right here and they can't touch your army. The Mutas die so quickly. But there's no force field until very, very late and you could have you could have almost lost that game. Uh, the War Prism was never brought up. So yeah, there's a lot of things you can do to improve this uh, this style of play, but you did pretty well. So uh, congrats for beating a master as a flat player. I'm sure you celebrated, uh, and there's a good reason to celebrate. Uh, but yeah, a wall, more gates, at least eight, a better macro. Don't make a row of pylons because eventually you're gonna be supply block make a make a pylon or two and then make units and make a pylon or two and make units and make a pylon or two and make four pylons in a row uh that's just not a way to play so um well yeah nice with the forge no wall probe probe uh probe making was good uh so i like that uh centuries they were late you made 10 you need eight uh but yeah and the, the push the push was good you could have attacked the links when they chase a little bit over here uh, but then you got scared for the mothership core, so you could have just uh, move everything and then do stop command on the Zod, so they would have turned back and start fighting. Uh, but yeah, thank you, Goatsy or uh, Doi Twin. Doi Twin. Butchered your name forever. Um. <laughs> but uh, yeah, thank you for submitting the replay, guys. That was game five of uh, Replay Thursday, episode 10. Uh, make sure to subscribe on YouTube. Uh, yeah, I've been a little inconsistent about uploading uh, replay Thursdays, uh, but I'll try to I'll try to be more consistent. There's, there's just so much to post nowadays. You know, the bronze to master, the guides, the good games versus Idra. Uh, there's just so much, but I'll try to be more consistent. Uh, I don't know. Maybe I'll do like two tomorrow morning, and then two tomorrow night, and then uh, one after that, and then maybe. Uh, post a playlist instead of posting one video one by one on YouTube uh, on Facebook Twitter but yeah guys thank you a lot for watching make sure to uh, you know f uh, follow Facebook Twitter uh, everything uh, slash just for fighting and uh, thank you for watching we'll be back next week with replay Thursday episode 11 peace